to me out here on the griddle, cooking breakfast can only mean one thing. Crabby woke up. I think it was a competition today between her and her son to see who's going to sleep the latest. We're here at Crabby Park in North Wildwood, New Jersey. Saturday morning. And it's already hot. been here in about four or five weeks. So, got lots of work to do. The gardens are a mess. Currently had them beautiful the last time we were here, but now they're full of weeds. So it looks like Stay at home day, do projects around here as usual, always projects to do. But I'm okay with it. Because I'm a good guy, I let her choose. She's very particular about her bacon and stuff. Say hello to the people. Excuse me? Good morning. It's still morning, it's not evening. Almost. Almost. Old Crabby, the only thing I wanted this weekend was to sleep late and have a nice breakfast. So I did technically sleep later than normal. I didn't sleep as late as I wanted to sleep. That's what I'm saying. But well, go ahead. You come and pee. She who thinks she's in charge. I'm roasting. All right, starting to get these projects done. The dogs getting their bath. I just pulled the deadheads off the marigolds out front. Lots of work to do out there with the garden, though. I trimmed this bush here. If you happen to know what that thing's called, please put it in the comments. Crabby's in charge of washing the dogs, amongst a million other things. Rosie had her bath already. Where you at, Rose? She just met the new neighbor's dogs. Nice, calm dogs. And we'll see how that works out for us, for the dogs. Wait till they meet Vito. Well, I had an awning company come out to look at this after 
I guess I called three different companies. I finally got one that, after uh, three different tries, he came out and looked at it and said, Dad, ah, just cut, trim off the broken parts. Don't worry about it. You don't need that part. So that's what I'm going to do. And hopefully this awning will continue to go in and out. Let's see what happens here. We weeded the uh, strawberries. There was so many weeds in there, you couldn't even see the plants. But, uh, there's still... Looks like there's still some fruit on them. And we're hopeful. A couple of weeds that we missed. I'm going to keep them nice and watered this weekend. Hopefully we'll rejuvenate them. And then we'll hopefully be down on a regular basis. Let's see what happens with these now. Here he is. There's a kid that needs a power washer full of sunblock before he goes to the beach. He's got that little spray can there of the probably expired stuff. He's putting it on. Meanwhile, his girlfriend will put baby oil on or olive oil or whatever it is. That she uses baking grease. This kid's going to come home. He's going to be red. Yeah. All right, Krabby, what do you got to say for yourself? Nothing? So what are you getting ready to quit? Jesus. Alright, so the gardens have been weeded. Things have been trimmed. The marigolds have been deadheaded. Been given some nice water. Should start perking up. Crabby and Rosie are still laying there in the shade. But I'm done now. I'm cleaned up. I guess the next thing I have to do is just cook her dinner. We'll see. Let's go check the strawberries. And look who's back from the beach. Stevie Lips and the beautiful Kinole. And how was the beach? Hot. Hot? Did you just have fun? Hot. Water was, Water was freezing. Nice. It's just what you want. We are quite sweaty. Ooh. Nice just to let you know, Quinn is laying in the air conditioning. Good for her. Nice. Come on, big girl. Come on. You need help getting up the steps? You don't, but I'll help you. It's a shame you didn't see that. Because as soon as I stood up to help her, as soon as I walked to the bottom of the steps, she started up the steps without me helping. So after relocating from the front deck to the back deck, Krabby yelled saying it's 40%, I don't know where she got that number from, 40% poor up here. So now we have to sit up here. I guess I don't need my hat anymore since I'm not in the sun. But it is a little bit more comfortable up here with my feet up on the railing. I can feel the sunburn on my face. See the beach, you can see the ocean. Looking forward to dinner. Dogs get to eat first. So as soon as she's done fixing them food, I guess she's gonna put me on the grill. Alright, here we go. Time to plop the uh, crab cakes on there. I'm gonna put them in there for to roll off the heat. I'm gonna turn this one down actually. So it's not so so much flame. But we're gonna have the crab cakes sit in there for 30 minutes. 
want to let it go for a while getting this good and hot and then I'm going to bring the uh, steak downstairs and I'm going to throw the steak on all right so I seared the steak on the griddle and then I'm going to finish it off on the grill along with the crab cakes the crab cakes which I usually throw in there for 15 or 20 minutes I didn't realize that the propane ran out so I'm not sure how long they were on there but we're going to uh, we'll just go by when the steak is done which is almost ready here we go nice ribeye bone in for me I might share a little tiny sliver maybe probably not with Krabby there's two crab cakes there but there's one over there we got nice potatoes we got tomatoes and cheese what kind of cheese is that fresh mozzarella, fresh mozzarella cheese potatoes steak crab cakes what are you thinking Krabby it's good delicious yeah. maybe she'll cook tomorrow All right, she's still here. <laughs> I thought she was giving up on me, but she's sticking around. Like a barnacle. <laughs> yeah, like a barnacle. Oh my gosh, it's hot. I just used the uh, infrared temperature thing for the griddle. I put it on the pavers. It was 109 degrees on the pavers. So we're sitting out here on the front porch. There's a little bit of a breeze. Got my hat on. She tells me to wear my hat. I don't need to wear it under here, though. I could smell bacon cooking somewhere, but it's not here. Too hot for breakfast. What do you got there, Krabby? Oh my god. What do you got? Too hot for breakfast. Yeah. Too hot for bike riding. Yeah. Too hot to trudge on the beach. Yeah. Just plenty too, too hot. hot. <laughs> so, probably well, sit here a little while and pack it in. All right, we're going to see if she sticks around longer. You'll find out next week if she's in the video. Thanks for watching. Please drink lots of water. Share, like, subscribe. If you have any questions, drop us a comment. And everybody have a good week and be safe. Thumbs up. See you next time.